this hallway is just so creepy. I'm like really shaky right now because the K2. It's flashing. I've never ever had any problems with this camera. If that's you, could you make it stop one more time? It's a pattern, right? That's the word I'm looking for. It's not like a pattern. Okay. Lights off. If that's you, could you make it stop one more time? Is there something you wanted to tell us? If yes, make it stop again. Bro, we just got here. The lights are still on. Like <laughs> <laughs> are we talking to the woman they referred to as the bride? If so, could you make the REM pod light up again? Are we talking to a female? If we are talking to a <laughs> Thank you. Is it okay if we're here tonight? If it's okay that we stay in your room tonight, could you make it light up? If it's not okay we're staying here tonight, can you make it light up? If you don't really care if we stay here tonight, could you make it light up for us? Please. Oh my god. Y'all, I have no makeup on or nothing, okay? <laughs> Is she laughing at me? <laughs> we're gonna die tonight. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go check out the next room. So we'll be right back to talk to you. Is that okay? If it's okay that we leave you for a little bit, could you make it light up just to confirm? Look at my key too. If you want us to stay here with you, could you make it light up? Okay, we're going to step out for a second. Thank you, though, for that. That was incredible. Jeez. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, we just got here. We put our stuff down. I'm charging my electricity stuff. Look at that. And she's going crazy. She's going off. Okay, but we got another room. This is a bright. This is not even how we were supposed to be starting. Mm -hmm. Okay, but we're gonna go to the other room. She's ready to party. She's ready to party. She's like, party. girls night. <laughs> Sleepover. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone. Welcome to Jan and Friends. I'm Jan, and today my two friends are Amanda and Cassie. You might have seen them before. They were with me at the Yorktown Memorial Hospital. And then Amanda's been a few other videos with me. But we are back together again. We're missing our fourth musketeer. Even though there's only three musketeers. But our fourth one, Kate. She is not here, unfortunately. But we miss her. We love her. And we're still thinking about her. So we are at the historic Jefferson Hotel in Jefferson, Texas. This is my second time here. This is their guys' first time here. And oh my God, did not disappoint the first time. And it's definitely not, dis it's kind of disappointing, but I'll get to it. But it's disappointing, <laughs> not disappointing the second time. 
So before I get into how we're feeling and stuff, let me just tell you a little bit about the place. Um, a very short summary. If you want more on the history of this place and what it was and the ghosts that reside here, you should go look at my first video that I ever did, my first paranormal experience and my first video on this channel. And it is, I forgot what it's titled to be honest, but I'll put it somewhere up here. But basically this place has been multiple things. It's been a bordel, it's been a hotel, it's been what it, a brothel or is that a bordel? Uh, I think they're cinnamon. So, and it's just been numerous things, and we are staying in the most haunted room. It is the bride's room. We have two ghosts that are very known here. We have Lydia the bride. Basically, her man stumped her and stood her up on the day of her wedding, and she was so devastated that she decided to take her own life by hanging herself above the bed. Specifically, this bed. And oh my God, the activity has been insane and we haven't even really started our investigation yet. And then we have a sex worker. I don't know her name. If I remember it, I'll insert it here too. But she was actually, poor baby, was murdered in the bathtub, the exact same bathtub that's in that restroom behind you. And then we have another room with the speakeasy. It doesn't really have like known ghosts in there, but this whole entire place is haunted. The whole place is haunted and then the owner, Jeremy, and his wife collect haunted objects and put them in here. So it's just haunted stuff in a haunted place. So everything is just super active. So right now the game plan is we're gonna go up to the attic, which is terrifying. And we're about to go up there and do a challenge of five minutes in the dark by ourselves and when I say by ourselves I mean one by one by ourselves so that's gonna be terrifying but that's gonna be only the first challenge we're doing tonight and then later we're gonna explore the speakeasy room and the bride room but 3 a.m. for the bride room we're gonna do the musical chair challenge <laughs> and I am so scared for that it was a TikTok that I saw and I was like that's scary we should do it You're so We'll see about that, but <laughs> that's what we have planned today, and oh my gosh, when I tell you, okay, I'm just gonna go ask you guys first, Cassie, what do you think of this place so far? What definitely, do you feel? I feel like this room, Lydia's room, is definitely the heaviest. As soon as you step in, you can feel it. You can feel her presence. There's definitely something powerful in here. Yeah, I feel like this room, we're gonna get some good footage. Good For footage. sure, and I'll insert it here, but Cassie got goosebumps. Like, as soon as she walked in, like, <laughs> we had full-on goosebumps. And then she said we'd get footage in here, hopefully, because I tried recording, as you guys are gonna see, and my camera just totally glitched, and my memory card was wiped out. And I brought three, and so far, two out of the three are not working, which... Has never happened to me. Maybe once in the Yorktown Memorial Hospital, I said card full, but I had other cards and it was fine. But no, now it's like draining batteries. Why? Just bought this battery. And we put it in. It's not working. <laughs> Bro. Checking shit out, so I'm kind of nervous and relying on this one memory card to pull through for the rest of the night. So God, I hope so. But Amanda, what do you think of this place? I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> it is cool. It is a cool place. I know. I mean, yeah. I this room specifically. I don't know that I feel energy. Something I sense stuff like that. Mm -hmm. But like we had that thing that happened in the beginning, like off the bat, you know, with the was it the room pod? Yeah. And I thought it was pretty cool. And I was because like we we're kind of communicating with her, and I was like, oh shit. Yeah. But then the other room feels really chill. Like. I was there by myself. It's really just, just this out. room. It's just, yeah. The only other one doesn't have like a history of anything that we know of. No, but like, it, it's just like this whole place holds history, but this room in particular just holds a certain dark history of it. Like the murder, the suicide, and it's just bad. And there's just so many stories about this room of people leaving in the middle of the night. It gave me, I did not stay here last time. Last time I was so scared that I stayed in my car. Like I have not been scared to the point where I don't stay in the building. But we got a lot of exploring to do, a lot of challenges to try, and a lot of communication to do. So 
stay tuned guys i'm already like Ugh. okay bye recording yeah oh that's scary damn the red pot is still going off the bride wants to speak to us Your butt. Do you want us to come back? If you want us to come back, make the REM pod go off again. What does she want then? He wants attention. Do you want attention? If you want attention, make the REM pod go off again. Now she want to be quiet. She's shy. Okay. <laughs> oh. It's like anytime we just like divert our attention away from her, she's like, wait. Women, I tell ya. <laughs> Women. <laughs> okay, can you handle this? I'm gonna try my best not to die. Okay, you can pass it down to me. We'll go down further. Uh, well, I'm trying to, I had to go down this way. Oh, hear my knees popping. <laughs> Why'd you go down that way? You don't go down the oh, 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 shit. <laughs> Oh my god, the. Oh, is there electricity right here? These are steep oh, ass god. stairs. God damn. Oh, you gotta be careful. <laughs> There's a door. Girly. <laughs> okay, we should just take the normal stairs back. That's so cool though. This is like the level. We're in the downstairs. Okay. Oh. That was a lot. <laughs> that was so much harder on you because you're tall. Yeah, I hit my knee. Oh my god, I love him. <laughs> he looks like a, a gerb. But yeah, if I really wanted to show y'all everything, oh, this video crazy. would be like three hours long. Okay, give the crowd what they want. <laughs> I know. would watch it. There's no one staying around our room though. So we can fart as loud as we want. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, look. This is so pretty. I'm in. I feel like we're in like, a, are we in a movie? <laughs> this is like a movie set. Oh, I posted it. Oh, I posted it. Oh, I knew that. Oh, I was like, what was that? And here we have the haunted doll, Eddie. Cute, creepy little guy. That's like Chucky's cousin. I wonder how this broke. He's like, let me out, let me out. He just bites me. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> Wait, where are we going? Did you want us to come in? Can we come inside the room? Do we have your permission to? If so, could you make that red light light up?
If you do not want us to come in the room, can you make the RAM pod go off? Hello, is anyone here? Is anyone here to talk to us? I guess not. It's on our way to her wedding. That was so insensitive. <laughs> <laughs> your ass is taking you here by yourself. <laughs> No, that's the reply. Were you upset about that comment? <laughs> that was JK, girl. <laughs> Did Amanda offend you? If she offended you, could you make the red light go off again? Like what you just did? I mean, really, we should be mad at the man here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Um, we're coming in. Do you want to continue talking to us? We're going to be here all night, so we have all night to talk. Yeah, oh, shit. <laughs> Bro, she got full on chills. Wait, why isn't it focusing? Oh my god, she got full on chills. She's wearing a jacket and the heater's on. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. And just like that, God, maybe she left the room. Did you leave the room? Hey, Lydia, we're gonna go get a snack, girl. Hey. We'll be back for you. You want something? Do you want us to bring you anything back? You hunkies? Do you want a new man? <laughs> okay. I'm turning this off. <laughs> Bro, do you not want me to get... Can you please stop? Is it more school? Can you, can you please... Do you not want me to get by the bed? <laughs> Is it okay if I get by the bed? Guys, you have to get really close to trigger that. Every time I get close to the bed, she doesn't want me there. Can you stop? the rib pop you have to be close to, touch to it. it you have to touch it every time i get close to the bed she doesn't want me there can you play this on your phone can you please stop thank you bro every time okay thank you stop please stop Are you mad? If you're mad at us, could you make that go off again? <coughs> if you want me to move from this spot, could you make it stop? So if you want me to move from your bed, could you make it go off? Sorry for the confusion, I just want to confirm. Like look guys, I'm going close to it and it's not going off. I don't... Are you guys taking room 11 and... 19, yes. Mm -hmm. 
Um, so I'm gonna be the one taking you up to the attic. This has been happening for like two minutes now. They recorded it on the phone when it first started happening. Lydia, are you here with us? Could you keep the lights on if you're here? Could you knock or give us an obvious sign that you're here? If it was a technical issue, it would not be doing this like, yeah. like, Those old it's, it's, a pattern. Pattern. it's a pattern, right? That's the word I'm looking for. It's not like random. It's, it's, it's like stranger things. <laughs> That's so weird. Lydia, can you give us an obvious sign? Or if we're talking to someone else, could you give us an obvious sign that you're here? You can make the lights turn off. You can give us a knock. Are we talking to anyone here? Okay, I'm gonna turn off the lights. Back to normal. <laughs> Back to normal, are you kidding me? If you want to show us that again, I'll turn off the lights and turn them back on. So when I turn them back on, you can make them flicker or do whatever you want again. Hmm. I didn't do it that time. But I also like debunks that that could have been something like technical. I'm like shook right now. What the fuck? I don't understand. My chest hurts. Like, I'm not even joking. My chest has been hurting this whole time. Is someone on the bed? If someone's on the bed, could you make that stop? Can you make that stop? Please? Could you make that stop? Thank you. Are you on the bed? To confirm that you are on the bed, could you make that stop? Is it okay that if Cassie's on the bed? I'm trying to talk to you, so could you make that stop, please? Thank you. 
Very on three, could you make that stop? One, two, three. Is it okay that Cassie's on the bed if she want me to get down? If you want Cassie to get off the bed, could you If you want Cassie to get off the bed, could you make that stop? Okay, let's see you get off the bed. That could be her. Oh, this shit's going crazy. It's a harmony. <laughs> okay, she's off the bed. You can make that stop. Thank you. <laughs> it has not turned back on. Here, turn on the lights real quick. Now it's quiet. You remember when the REM pod was right here and every time I got close to the bed, it would go off? I feel like the energy is like right there. Oh my God, it's not even focused. Oh, there it goes. Bro, now it's silent. It's hushed. It was yelling at you. Was that light flashing at No. So the REM pod has been telling us that it doesn't want us to get near the bed. I don't know if that's a warning. I don't know if that's a preference. Like they just doesn't that it just doesn't want us there because that's her space. But y'all heard how crazy that REM pod was going off. And as soon as Cassie got over here, it has not gone off since. And every time I would walk towards the bed, it would go off. Like, something does not want us near that bed. And that's where people are supposed to sleep. <laughs> if you don't want us to go to your bed, could you make the rim pod go off? <laughs> okay, thank you. I said thank you and it just stopped. I'm I'm over to the bed. <laughs> she said no ma'am. If you don't want me to go to the bed. <laughs> Can I lay down with you? If you want me to lay with you, make that stop. If you don't, she wants me to lay with you. If you're next to me, could you make the REM pod go off or make this device in my hand turn red? We just want confirmation. You can use all the energy from our phones, from the batteries that you need to let us know that you're here with us. I'm gonna end this session soon. We're definitely gonna come back and talk to you, but right now we got other stuff to visit. So if you want us,
say something now or make an obvious sign now. Now is the time. Okay, thank you so much for talking to us. That could be me. I'm going to turn this off now. Thank you. So we're waiting on our little tour guide. And I mean little, I literally mean little. She's a child, but she's <laughs> going to take us to the attic. And while we wait for her, we came to the speak easy room because we felt like the other room was literally draining our energy and we feel so much better in here it feels lighter it feels brighter so that room is just heavy heavy and yeah so good thing we booked two rooms because i'm gonna stay here tonight okay i don't know how to turn it on up the attic we go Thank you. But what I usually yeah, do is like I get comfortable in that room and usually stuff goes on in this. So okay. we should get in there. Probably. So uh, do you guys know anything about a disappointment room? Let's just say we don't because I do but they don't. Alright so like what do you know about it basically? I think it's like right with like the disabled or autistic or basically yeah. anyone oh, not accepted of That's society. That's exactly like how it is. So they would be yeah. put in a room to basically yeah. just hide from society. Yeah. Uh, that's that's kind of um, that's actually like actually it. <laughs> but it's also um, if like you had triplets, anything that like anybody that would look different compared to normal people, I guess. Back in they do like they would put you in a room. Some would have doors, but it would be locked, or some had windows that like were covered completely. Mm -hmm. Um, and they would like keep the kid in there until they were like eight, nine, or ten, or older, and kill them. Yeah. So they would kill them. They, they wouldn't would even like no, let they them grow up. Let them go. They would just kill them because it was just. I guess it was too big of a disgrace for them because mm -hmm. of the other people shaming them about their kid. Mm, that's so sad. It is. Um, but for this one, what happened mainly in this one, this one, there's a, a dad, a mom. So what does that mean? It just means, it's like someone's still like around it, like touching it. Like, could you make that stop, please? Thank you. Yep. I guess it just it wants it safe. Um, but then there's um, triplets in here. Okay, so there's triplets. triplets in here. Identical triplets. Like, mainly, they would have to be, like, identical for them to put it in there because it would all look the same and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. um, so, there's identical triplets. One's named Alice, one's named Jada, and one's named Jade. Alice is the oldest, is 10, and then Jada is 9, and then Jade is 8, I believe. Yeah, 8. Um... And people ask me if there's identical triplets and why are they different ages. It be, it's because when they all said eight, one got killed. Another nine, um. ten. And then um, the dad was the one that killed him. And I found out later on. Well, sorry. <laughs> uh, later on I found out that the mom was abused from the father. Mm -hmm. And the father was the one that killed him. And she didn't want that to happen. And she's known for crawling. Like crawling away, basically. Oh, gosh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen it because I'm a medium. Oh, okay. uh, I can hear, see, and I can feel. And uh, I've seen it two times, I believe, or three. Well, one thing I noticed last time that I noticed right now, too, is the, the tightness in my chest. I have that right now, yeah. It feels so heavy up here. Plus, I don't really like sitting like back. 
mm -hmm. like, like here, mm -hmm. like on this chair. But like I was like, I have to sit on the chair, especially over there. But like, yeah, I don't like sitting on that chair because that's a triplets chair. Oh, that the whole couch thing is that that's there. I remember sitting there the first time, and I guess I think someone had like a um, detector, like a temperature detector, mm -hmm. and there's a full on two butts right next to me like heat. oh the heat the oh. heat oh my matter. god it was like right next to me and i was like okay <laughs> okay so i'm gonna That's turn great. this on then and we'll see if on the triplets sure and i remember getting up and like walking over because they were like here wait get up to see like if it was you and there was another one and it's it was been like a few minutes and then there's three yeah all right well let's go in guys so does anybody want to stay out here first? Or do you guys all want to go in there first? Oh! It's spiking. Yep, it's spiking. It went all the way to uh, orange. I saw I go to red a little. Yeah, the, yeah, like orange or red. As okay. soon as I turn off the light and we're saying we're going to go in there. Okay. Yep. Jackson, you can sit on that little area right there, okay? Yeah, you can get crawl behind me. So how do you feel up here, Jackson? Um, me. Are you feeling him? him a bit. Yeah. So, him is the guy, the father, because we don't really know the name. He doesn't like giving us the name. He just gives random names every single time we ask him. Interesting. I don't really, I'm not really big fan of him. Mm-hmm. Because he's like, not a good vibe. Good point. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> but no, um, that's why. Here's your thing. Uh, so I have crystals, and then I put some crystals in a little container for him too. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We don't want him around. But he usually just comes in because this is where I think they lived back in the day. Because this. This place has been so many things. So in this particular room, how you know that there's little kids is because there's nail scratched mm. marks Aww. all the way down. Yeah. And the... like obviously they wouldn't have like nail like supplies or they have long nails. It goes all the way down. If anybody is here with us, can you please make a sound like um a sound that we can all hear, please? If it's like the mother, the triplets, or it's basically the same thing, kind of. Well, they were talking about the the rim pod. Oh. They could do the rim pod. Oh. Heard that? That was my tummy, I think. No, it's the noise over there. It was all the it way out there. there. It was mm -hmm. all the way out there. It was on like hear the that. side where um, where I was saying I saw people, or like thought I saw some people. Could you make it louder? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for that. Can you try to make a louder sound like close to us so we can hear it loud? If that's possible, can you please do it in a few minutes, please? So we're gonna do a little challenge here. So our friend, what's your name? McKenna. McKenna said that out there in the attic is a little bit more activity, a little bit more scary. We're protected here in the disappointment room by the triplets, so we're going to switch the challenge where one by one we're going to sit out there and I'll have you guys talk and ask questions because we heard a chair move and knocks and such, so mm -hmm. I'm like, my heart's beating really fast. <laughs> but okay, I'm going to go out there now. And yeah, y'all can just ask questions. Oh. This is a terrible idea. <laughs> Don't say that, Jackson. <laughs> Positive. Oh, it's so Make sure you don't hit your head above the, the thing at the Thank you. Just so roll fast. back down. <laughs> <laughs> it happens a lot to everybody because it's like, oh, you don't expect it to be there because you're like, oh my god, I just stared. Like, just walk out and you just go, oh, crap. <laughs> 
so I'm up in the attic. Hi guys. If anybody is in here with us still, can you please make a knock or a sound again? Pretty loud up there so we can hear it, please. No. And I'm just like really shaky and like you can see like I'm gonna cry. I hear breathing. Me and Cassie are being a little crazy and we're gonna go down where we hear the noises. I thought fucking chill. 